Hello everyone, my name is Om Sagasol. This is Android App Development 2017. In this video, I will teach you how to use a spinner in Android. Okay, let's go to Android. Okay, assume that you have the basic project like that. So let me delete this first. So just drag the spinner here. Okay. And now it looks good and click on info constraint to make it proper and then just uh, rename it so i want to make like uh, you want to choose a major from you know uh, your university kind of like student thing you know so here just grab the spinner like usual sp uh, Spinner and then find view by ID or SP major. Okay, and now we need an adapter, so just use a ray adapter here. And we just want to make it basic, so well, I don't want to make a like a custom array adapter or whatever, just a simple array adapter. So it's called adapter here, new array adapter. And then the first one is contact, just call get application context. It's very safe because the code can be cut and passed uh, you know, to some method and get application contact is better than just this, you know. And then the second one is the layout and you can use uh, android.all.layout.simple uh, spinner item, it's just a uh, built-in layout okay and the third one is the data so now we don't have any data there so just clear like an array list new array list Now let's add some data. So first let's call computer science data add grayson. Okay, just two data is enough. And now you have the array adapter and finally just uh, add the array adapter to do that. So just call set adapter and put the adapter like this. Okay. Let's run it. Okay, so there is a data here, but uh, the data now is, you know, the color is white, so you cannot see, but actually there is a computer science and business administration over here. So just to change the, the text color. So a little bit tricky for this one. Because now we don't use any custom layout, so it's very difficult if you want to change this. This is the building. So I suggest you just create a simple uh, custom layout. So just go back to rest here. And then layout. And right click and then new. And XML layout. This is how you create a layout. Okay. And just call spinner layout okay and then just grab a text like that so one text is fine but um, if you want to embed the data into the text um, you have to create a custom class here but uh, it's a little bit more complicated so to make it simpler just go here and delete the layout here. Now you have only one text. Then you can embed the text as the layout for the spinner adapter, for the array adapter, okay? And now we got another problem because we don't have the uh, namespace. So let me go back and grab this text. Just this type, that's fine, and pass it here. Okay, now it's fine and go back to main activity. 
instead of using this so we're using the, the spin layout that we just created so here now spin layout okay run it again now the tag is better but the tag is not clear so we have to go back to spin again and maybe uh, change the text color here so text color and I want to change to uh, black so uh, you have to write uh, six digit if you uh, use the three digit gonna have some error okay like this and run again okay now much better okay so this is how you create the spinner in android so that's it for this video i will make more videos about more advanced stuff about custom array adapter custom layout but this is the basic so i hope you like it and please don't forget to subscribe to this channel give a thumb up to this video thank you and i will see you in the next video